right, what up YouTube? So I had a couple people ask me about the window 10 exemption video that I made. Um, it's changed a little bit since then. I think I posted that video in maybe what, February. Um, and then shortly after the Department of Public Safety for Texas actually stopped with the window 10 exemptions. I think the video got like 200,000 plus views in a week and I guess they got flooded and said, fuck it, no more exemptions. But you can still get exempt. So check this out. So uh, basically in Texas, without an exemption, you have to have 25% uh, the dark as you go up front. You can, I mean, you can paint your rear windows. You can do whatever the hell you want with the rears. Uh, they don't, there's no you know, limits to that. The windshield, from what I understand, is you can't do any tint on it whatsoever um, unless it's like 100% clear. And clear for them is going to be about 70% is what I understand. Um, I know people run 50% on the windshield. They don't get messed with. I personally run 30. I've only had one cop ever notice it, and uh, he literally just gave me a warning, and I think part of that was because I told him that uh, my 10 exemption also covered the windshield, and he, you know, it's like, like, if you have an exemption already, it's literally like a, it's like a big ass, I mean, it's a couple paragraphs, but I personally, I, I haven't even read the whole thing myself ever, but I just told him it was, it was, it was included on it. He's like, oh, okay, cool. So anyways, I don't think they're too big on windshields. I think if you were to run 50, you're probably not going to get messed with. 30, you do run the risk of getting pulled over. So basically what I'm getting at here is they have no exemption anymore. So all you have to do now is, what I understand, is you literally just get a doctor's note. So look, so look, this is about right when the video kind of went out, uh, you know, January, February. And then, uh, let's see. This is what you need now. A signed medical exemption statement will suffice as proof of a medical exemption so if you're wanting to be exempt basically that just means you need to have a doctor sign off on it so you could have I mean your normal family doctor your eye doctor I mean I don't, maybe even a freaking dentist could sign off it I really don't think they're gonna care um, as long as you physically have that piece of paper in your vehicle when you get pulled over and you show that to them you can run up to certain limits so for example, the darkest they're gonna allow for your front windows is 5%. I, my, mine, you know, mine's limo, because they don't necessarily make a 4%, they make a 2%, but stuff does read out differently. So if you ever have somebody, uh, you know, put the, the, they have like a tent meter, it goes, clips on, clips on your, on your window like that, and it reads the measure of tent, you know, there. Um, you know, if you're right around five, I don't think you're gonna get a ticket. Mine reads out to three, like I was saying, and, uh, you know, I, I've had a couple guys put a put a meter on it, and you know I just always explain you know this is kind of like driving thirty five and a thirty seven, or I'm sorry thirty seven and a thirty five. You know it's two over. It's not a big deal. And uh, you know sometimes with tent too is if if your windows are dirty they're gonna appear way darker. I'm sure y'all know that guys with window you know window tent. I I don't even like putting Windex on my windows anymore because I it you know, it's darker when they're dirty. So I'm kind of cool with them being dirty. Um, but yeah, so that's, that's where I'm going with this. So no exemption. You all, all you need is a doctor's note now. Um, I also found this tent law website. They have it for all the, all the states. What I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and do a video for every state. I mean, not all at once, cause I'm not trying to flood y'all with the same tent video for 50 different states, but so only one I'm focused on today is Texas, by the way. I live out here in Dallas. Uh, actually just bought a house in fate. So if anybody knows where that's at, um, that's where you might be able to see me. If you ever see my truck too, give me a rolling pick. Uh, but yeah, so here we are again. Um, basically, they don't mention anything much about the windshield. Um, the one thing that they do say though is your ASA, AS1 lines. Basically, you know how people have like a brow. It's that piece that goes around the top. Um, it can't be, you know, more than five inches. And basically, your, your, wind, your windshield's probably gonna have a little line too that says AS1. It's gonna be on the top left and the top right. Uh, can't go past that. That'll get you a ticket. Um, no exemption for the brows either. So there's no exemption for windshields. There's no exemption for brows. The only thing the exemption gives you is 5% up front. Um, but yeah, that's going to be today's video. I just want to go over that with y'all. If you want to read this, pause it because I'm not trying to read all that myself. Um, anyways, follow me on Instagram at RPBC1. Y'all have a good one. Peace.